Hello, folks. Brad coming at you here with a little soccer mail. Football. So I know about 10 of you will appreciate this video. So I got Germany in two breaks. Did okay. Got a hit in each. And I hit this Cyrillic, I think is how it's pronounced. Cyrillic. The Cyrillic variation card where they use the alphabet there. That is supposed to be Julian Drexler. Could you have figured that out for Germany? I had two breaks with Germany. So that was cool. And I hit the signature moments autograph card of Maria Goza. Good player. Commemorating the 2014 World Cup. Rescored. It is all uh, sticker autos except for one set. There's like five people that have on cards. And those look pretty good. But the rest of it is all sticker. But as I told everyone, because the Topps Champion League Chrome product came out. And everyone's like, oh man, I think that'll actually be better than World Cup. Pro I'm like, no, it won't. And it doesn't sell for crap. And it's so hard to hit any good names. At least in World Cup Prism, every case you usually get at least two good name autographs out of it at least. But yeah, the Topps Chrome version really wasn't very good at all. And it didn't sell well. So I was right. I was like, I'll get into World Cup Prism. I'm not touching the Topps Chrome stuff. And I was right. Um, so yeah, Mario Goza. And this stuff sells a lot better than that Chrome did. It's just the way it is. But, uh, and then the other autograph, old timer here. Is he still playing in the MLS or did he finally retire? Boston Schweinsteiger. Old German legend there. And it's all on the sticker, I think. Oh, uh, Maybe the very bottom where he came down might be just off. But pretty good. So not bad there. But to the break I crushed, I bought Mexico one time. This was with KIT Authentics, who usually doesn't do soccer. So that's how I was able to get Mexico. Because you would think the main soccer breakers would know how to price the soccer better. But they have Mexico at 65 bucks. And in my opinion, they're – I'd have them maybe as the fourth or fifth best team in World Cup Prism. But that price point doesn't reflect it. Um, so they all have them too cheap. They all have them in that 65 or 69 range. So I don't know if they've adjusted them yet, but – and that's why they're one of the first teams gone all the time at that price because it's like – it's a steal, and people will have like Spain at a hundred bucks. When Spain, in my opinion, should be less than Mexico. So, yeah, I would have thought this. I would understand like the non-soccer breakers not really know what they're doing, but the soccer breakers didn't have that price right. So I don't know if they fixed it yet or not. But I got three autographs. You get six or seven in a case. I got three of them, and they're all good too. Like they aren't like crap. <laughs> So like I said, Mexico is the best buy if you find them under 70 bucks all day. You want to do some World Cup Prism. But good luck finding them. You'll have to pretty much break with a non-soccer guy to find them. But uh, first up, we'll do worst to best. And even this is like a $50 auto. Luis Hernandez. I don't really know him. Luis Hernandez. Look at those flowing locks. Mexico's all-time leading scorer at the World Cup. Hernandez did all his damage in 98, scoring four times in France, including twice versus Korea Republic in the opening match. There you go. I never heard of him, not going to lie. And then this guy, oh, man, Blanco, but Cuatimio-ish Blanco. He's got to have a nickname.
another 1998 World Cup guy. But Blanco, very nice. Good to bam. And then good old, the third one, Javi Hernandez, good old Chicharito. Good bam. Beautiful autograph on that one, too. So, absolutely killed that break. That was the birthday break. I got into it on my birthday. Bam. Worked out well. So, uh, yeah, there's some soccer. Can't really break down soccer for you. But, uh, yeah, that was a good break. Um, so, yeah, if you can find them, Mexico, under 75 bucks. You can buy them all day if you want to do some World Cup. Uh, all the cheap teams, like the $8 teams you'll see, can all hit parallels and stuff. Sometimes that's the way to go if you just want looking for that. But, uh, yeah, I think that's all I got. Majestic football comes out this week. Looks about like last year. So it was decent. It was just overpriced, but it was decent. Um, National Treasures basketball came out last Friday. <laughs> Oh, gosh. I did two breaks of that, and that's all I'm doing. It's just not a very good product at all. Obviously, you're just big hit chasing, and the product itself kind of stinks. But I actually did all right. I hit a Rick Barry auto, and I have an RPA that I hit with the Bucks. So I had worries and Bucks. Uh, but, yeah. So NT basketball, stay away. I'm just saying. So, yeah, that's all I got. If you're interested in any of the soccer, let me know. Bye-bye, folks.